Thank you, Chairman. Uh, honorable Ministers, Your Excellencies, Distinguished Delegates, on behalf of the Government of the United Republic of Tanzania and my delegation allow me to first extend our appreciation to the Government of Romania for hosting this conference and for the hospitality extended to us in this beautiful city of Bucharest since our arrival. I would like to express our heartfelt congratulations to you, Mr. Chairman, on your election to chair this plenipotential conference of the ITU. On behalf of the United Republic of Tanzania, we wish to congratulate the newly elected ITU Secretary General, Ms. Doreen Bogren Martin. As an African country, we hope that your vision, commitment, and determination will accomplish the real needs of member states and the interests of developing countries such as Tanzania. Chairman, allow me also to join the voice of those who have already expressed gratitude to the Secretary General, Mr. Holland Zhao, and the staff of the ITU for successfully organizing this conference and for the work they have done in the past four years in spearheading the implementation of union resolutions despite of the effects brought by the COVID pandemic. Tanzania has been active in various ITU initiatives which emanate from the resolutions agreed by member states. We have adopted pro-ICT policies and supportive legislation to build an ICT-driven nation towards achieving sustainable digital transformation through the following initiatives. First, investment in digital infrastructures such as the National ICT Broadband Backbone which connects all administrative districts, headquarters, regions, and uh, all landlocked neighboring countries. Second, by having in place a legal framework that has a red digital transformation that helped in increasing ICT applications in various sectors of the economy, including agriculture, health, and education, among others. Chairman, recently, Tanzania has introduced in the parliament the Data Protection Bill, a critical component of African Vision 2030. We look forward to passing this law in the next few months to further open the country to investment for the wider benefit of Tanzanians and the region. Chairman, Tanzania is working very closely with the ITU to bridge the digital divide through the use of telecommunications and ICT solutions, especially in addressing the needs of the most marginalized members of a society, namely women and girls, youth, older persons, and persons with disabilities. ICT innovations have today made it possible for the millions of formerly unbanked populations of Tanzania, mostly living in rural communities, to be financially included via mobile money. Today, there are more than uh, 35 million users of mobile money compared to 23 million users in the year 2018. We have put efforts in building institutions that will help digital transformation in the country. These institutions include the ICT Commission and the Universal Communication Services Access Fund, which to date has connected more than 12 million population living in rural areas to broadband connectivity. As we gather at the ITUPP 2022, we believe that Tanzania's experience in the communication sector can best fit and be shared with the ITU family, especially at this juncture when the sector is fast evolving and the international community is still utilizing information and communications technologies as tools for social and economic development. I therefore wish to reaffirm our commitment to cooperate and share with the other member states the ITU Secretariat and the regional offices to make ITU an eminent international body that continues to play its role in enhancing social economic development of all member countries. As such, Tanzania has put its candidature to the seat of the ITU Council representing Region D. We are requesting all ITU members to vote Tanzania to the ITU Council so that we can share our experiences with the ITU family and the further contribute to our shared objectives of the ITU. And uh, as you have seen, we are 
inviting all to join us this evening at 5.30 uh, to our reception whereby you can enjoy the kindness of the land of Kilimanjaro, Ngorongoro Kreta, and Serengeti and Zanzibar. Chairman, on behalf of the government of Tanzania and my delegation, I would like to express my profound gratitude once again to the government of Romania for hosting this remarkable conference and wish success in its deliberations. Thank you very much.